light an incense. Incense are chill, so light an incense for you all. What's going on YouTube? It's Danny Certified here back with another video and I'm just at a different space right now, man. Like I'm totally at a different space. And what I mean by that is that sometimes when I wanna bring YouTube content to my page, it is the hardest freaking thing to come up with. I create YouTube content, sometimes like you can over, like I swear to God, yo, like I promise you guys, like I, I really overthink it. And times where it's like, I go weeks, bro, like weeks thinking like what, the fuck am I going to do this I don't know man I think I, I'm, I'm going to take a different approach here um, going forward um, so what I'm gonna do is this is this is not scripted sometimes some videos that I have I write down things um, that way I can kind of keep a line but this is all free form I'm just literally like turn on the damn camera and let's record because um, hindsight uh, I will if you have, I will put them in the description pa a YouTube page and he has like a podcast it's like on Apple pop you know all platforms whatever I'm not about to go through them. but uh, um god damn bro can't talk that's how you know I'm doing this on the fly but on one episode he just he just stressed it to where you're overthinking and it's like I when it comes to this YouTube stuff man I swear like I, I overthink it sometimes and it's like a YouTube video and I get inspired and I'm like you know what I'm gonna kind of flip it around but when I'm gonna come to you all is sometimes sometimes you just gotta fucking do it like when Nike say just do it like I really really feel that because it's like I waste so much like bro I, I have so many videos that I can put on YouTube so many I, I record so many I literally like it's ridiculous change some things around so this is what i'm gonna change and i'm, I'm, I'm gonna give this information to y'all if you want to try because i'm gonna try it out for a week to see how it goes and i'm gonna really do it so i have two phones i have my personal phone and i have my old phone so what i'm going to do is and also i work from home so i'm always home a lot so um i'm going to try and delete every single social media I'm not gonna try, I, I'm going to. I'm gonna delete every single social media that's on my main phone, just delete everything. Um, and then just keep all my social media and everything on my second phone. Um, that way if I'm out and about, I'm not checking my feed. It been times where I'm sitting here at the computer and just wasted like 40 minutes just scrolling on TikTok. Mind you, TikTok is a gold mine. TikTok definitely, definitely can um, give you some information on like anything. So. TikTok is a gold mine, but the thing is, you can get lost in TikTok and you get lost and you, and you sit in there and you're like 40 minutes in, 50 minutes in, an hour in, you're like, shit. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I'm gonna just straight delete like every single social media on my phone. That way I'm not like, I'm still have it on this. So if I'm at home, this phone's gonna be, you know, around, but it's not gonna be here with me. The only phone that I'm gonna have with me is my main phone. And my main phone is gonna be the way my you know, clients can get in touch with me. Yeah, you get the point. Um, but I'm gonna try that out for a week to see because I feel like I can get lost in social media, and I feel like sometimes social media can drain me away from my from my creative uh, from me being creative. Social media is a nerve wracking, bro, because it's like everyone has this, everyone has this, and if you don't have it, you're lying. It's like you see things and you want it, like you. It's a, it's a, it's natural. So when you see these people going on vacation and uh you know buying a new house you know getting a new car like people post it on social media and, it, and it's like you're going outside to an 03 hyundai accord like hyundai accord what if you got a picture of a hyundai accord send that to me uh <laughs> you know what i'm saying like you want these things yes social media is is it's painful social media is painful but the, you can't those are highlights of life people won't post the sad i mean people will post some sad shit which that's not me you know i'm not sitting here click and record on my phone camera and sitting here and crying y'all i can't do that no but it's it's addictive man it's addictive and 
I'm here to say I'm I'm not gonna say I'm addicted to social media, but I can definitely get lost in social media at important times. So I know how to put the phone down. Like if I need to get down to business and stuff, I know how to do that. But when it comes to like me sitting here, like you see my calendar, like some like I need to actually get ready to switch this calendar from May to June, get everything together. Uh, and when I did, I did that at the end of April. Like I literally put my phone down for about the rest of the night, like literally. Uh, and I got so much done. Like I got literally two videos that I dropped, like YouTube videos that I've never dropped that many. I've never dropped two videos in a week. And I'm aiming to aim three. This I'm, uh, My goal is to get this one done within the next few days. Editing is so much easier. Like people say, you know, don't go to school, you wanna waste some money, blah, 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 go on YouTube. Yes, that is true. But school has unlocked so much potential that I did not know I had. It just made my life easier when it comes to editing. I, I, I swear to you, I've been editing the long way. And I think what happens is the results that you get is laziness because I'm doing so much to get to that point where I feel like it's I'm, I'm just done with it because it's, it's I've been doing it. I've been editing for so long. So now that I have a point where like, bro, I can chop up a video within like a couple hours. It's to the point where I, I'm having issues with closing the video out because I got too much shit. I just feel so much relieved, man. Like, I'm not quite quite yet where I want to be with YouTube, but I'm finally finding that system to where I'm making it easy for myself. I'm, I, I'm doing a bunch that I can now. That way, when I take a break, you know, these videos are here for you all to cycle. So, at the beginning of the semester, I put my phone on screen time. So I give myself, I think like six hours on all social media platforms, which is still kind of too much. Life is getting so much easier with this YouTube stuff, man. I'm finding a system where I'm, I'm comfortable and I'm getting videos out. And I think what I was aiming for my YouTube channel to be at the beginning, I, I'm kind of shifting gears. Like I'm not even bringing you all camera, camera uh, information, but I feel like with the camera information, you have to be so precise. And I don't want that. Like I don't, I was watching other YouTube channels that do, you know, talk cameras and things like that. I will talk cameras once I get cameras and stuff like that. But I'm gonna tell you now, you give me any camera I can work with. I'm not the one to look at, you know, I, well, it is important to look at the spec stuff when you purchase and stuff, but you get that type of following. You have to, it's like, it's tedious, like tedious, I should say. Like you have to know everything from the numbers. And I'm not, I'm not, that's not me. So it's just here for motive. I'm here for motivation for any freelancer videographer that are, that is in my shoes. Cause I'm not even there where I want to be. You see, excuse me. You see where I'm at. Like I'm literally in my apartment and I've got a care. Uh, like this here is a dining room table. Like the dining room table is my desk. Like when I say I'm starting literally from just a dining room area i really mean that and i want to show you all the growth like it is it is possible like you just got to unlock some shit just to kind of get some shit going you feel what i'm saying so you never know like i'm gonna take it to a video game because i play a lot of video games when you play the game you hit milestones when you hit milestones you unlock things right but as you play the game if you just playing the game and not doing the certain missions and stuff like that you're not unlocking those milestones so treat life as a fucking game people say life is not a game yes it is like the game is to stay out of jail stay alive and be successful that's the fucking game i appreciate you all just taking the time out just to just to watch the video man because it takes a lot to set this camera up set these lightings up in this freaking small ass area i'm just glad you all are here um on my grind on my journey um, if you haven't check out my last two videos i have one for my son my documentary i introduce him to the world um that's a dope thing too bro because like he can like when he gets older and stuff like that like the title is the book of nods your documentary that's for him when he gets older he's going to be able to see this stuff and it's just this is his documentary like when i deliver this stuff to you it's it's more than just me delivering to youtube like these are freaking memories that i'm putting to you all so everybody can freaking see and i think that's what is wrong with a lot of the african-american community no one documents shit no one it's like african-american community sometimes is like so freaking closed in like i don't want nobody to know what i did you know i don't want that blah blah i don't want this but that's the issue that's the issue until we figure out if we want to do if, if we until we figure out if we want to be together we're going to be separate 
you you got to get off your ass and want it yourself that's simple simple like I said, I really do appreciate everyone here. Uh, let's try to get 25 likes on this video. I don't think I have no videos with 25 likes, which is freaking shocking. I have like 100 and something views on some videos, but nobody likes it. So we're just wrapping up. Second quarter is wrapped up in June. So just keep going. Just keep going, man. Do not give up. You see, I'm still here. Um, my first video was in December. And look how that shit looks like. Like, look how they look. Compared to now, like the growth will come. I, 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 the lights I started with was like some big ass light bulbs that I eventually broke, bro. But it, none of this was in the background. Y'all remember I had one strip of line. Like y'all seen that video, man. Like, like I promise you, man, the growth will come. You just gotta keep going, keep practicing. That's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna be trying to do some music videos here soon because, like I said, I like to do music videos and I don't have any goddamn music videos. So. Um, I'm gonna be shooting some music videos here soon. Um, I actually got an artist that I just hooked up with because it's, it's hard to find a freaking artist, man. I think what it is is that I didn't want to do. I don't think I'm a tr like the trap rap whatever. I don't think I'm. I'm think I'm at the age. <laughs> that is crazy, bro. We getting old, bro. Like I'm at the age now where I'm like I don't enjoy that. Like I mean it's cool, you know. Like I got some people in the city that I rock with. Like yeah, it's it's definitely some people that I rock with. It's just. That ain't my, I can't, I'd rather listen to it. I can't, I can't keep up with the visuals and shit. Probably too. <laughs> Some slow shit, man. That's just what I am. Like, Wiz Khalifa is like one of my favorite rappers. And y'all get the point. Like, people that like the, and the artist that I got, he's literally chill, everything like Wiz. Like, how the Wiz type vibe you get. I just can't wait, yo. So, overall, man, like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this up. Um, Just keep going. I think I say that with so many videos. Keep going. Do not get discouraged. Uh, like I said, I'm not even getting results on some of my... I mean, I'm not getting the results that I want. But now I think I'm at like 68 as I checked. We aim it to 100. Like I said, what's something in the first or second quarter that, that you're doing or currently... Uh, I'm sorry, that you're currently doing or that you already done um, that you just want to share with us, you know, the followers. Make sure you like, subscribe to the channel, man. Uh... I love you all. I appreciate you all stepping in and, and clicking on this video and just checking me out. Um, like I said, put that in the comments down below, man. And I'm out.